Jeff Dodgeskids here and I want to just talk to you about the GoPro Hero 4 and whether it'll be a good camera for you. Oh man, this is steep, isn't it? <laughs> I knew that. what you want to use the camera for. I don't think it, the GoPro Hero 4 is the camera for me because things like battery life, they've changed the camera battery position. I always use the battery backpack because I like to switch it on and then leave it on for however many hours it lasts for. Well at the moment it will last about two and a half hours probably with my battery and battery backpack so then you have to swap the battery every two and a half hours but a month ago there's a new battery backpack and battery combined that came out made by Wasabi batteries and it makes the Hero 3 Plus because the Hero 3 uses more power than the Hero 3 Plus so I'm talking about the Hero 3 Plus all right and it makes it last five hours at 30 frames per second five hours and then you change the battery and you probably need to change out the SD card as well. The quality of the footage, the Hero 3 Plus is better than the 4. It's brighter, I'll say. If anyone's following the reviews and things, there's that one guy who's been making videos. That deaf guy, I don't know what it is. Starts with M. He's been making comparisons and his 3 Plus camera seems to be out of focus for long distance. And does everyone remember the 3 Plus was out of focus compared to the 3? And then, well I don't know if you've heard about it, but there's the Infinity Focus mod that you can do to your 3 Plus. Apparently though, the later 3 Plus models had the issue fixed. So if you get a 3 Plus now, there's a good chance that it will have Infinity Focus and the focus will be just as good as the 4. Or you could just modify it with the Infinity Focus, just turn the lens. So basically the quality is the same, it's just the features that have changed. And realistically, who's going to be filming in 1080p 120, like, often? Like, how much battery life is that really going to give you in the end? And battery life's the killer, isn't it? No one wants an hour, you know? But with the 3 Plus, you can get the aftermarket battery and it will last for 5 hours. So the 3 Plus seems more appealing to me with the longer battery life just as good quality and you can use 1080p at 60 frames a second and it will last more than three hours so what's more attractive that or some 1080p at 120 frames per second that you only got to use once or twice and especially 4k as well imagine the battery life on that you can't just turn it on 4k and think oh, okay i'll replace the batteries in two hours well you won't You'll be replacing it a lot earlier than that. So it really becomes impractical for at least, you know, action. I go out on my bicycle rides. When I first got the camera right, when I first got the three, I obviously knew that I wanted more battery life. So I got the backpack. And you obviously, you find out that if you don't turn it on and off all the time, you'll get longer battery life if you just turn it on once. So what I, I did was I bought another battery and another battery backpack and then I've got five hours of footage so I can go out on five hour bicycle rides and know that the camera's going to go for the whole time and I just replace the battery halfway you know you go out on five hour motorcycle rides or two hour or whatever right but you can't use the 1080 well you can but who wants to pull over every what 30 minutes or an hour if you're lucky for to to be filming in 4k so anyway, I've got the Hero 3 Black at the moment and the 3 Plus definitely is an upgrade. The battery life is 20% longer lasting. So I'll be able to get five hours recording time. But I've got the 3 Black, so I can do these, you know, 60 frames a second and all that. But the battery life isn't as good as it is with the 3 Plus. So the 3 Plus definitely looks attractive, but the 4 
with the new battery and you can't use your old batteries and it won't get anywhere near five hours record time for sure let's run through the list the four gopro hero four is all it does all the differences the battery is different so you can't use your old battery and you can't use this new battery that lasts five hours etc you can't use that you've got your 1080p at 120 which you're going to use about once seriously i've used 120 720p on my three black one time and that's it you know never going to use it again it's not useful so obviously with an action cam you just you want to you want to record time and which the three plus has has the record time now with the new battery so with the four you're not going to use 120 frames per second you're not going to use that and the 4k the battery is just going to run out too fast so that's not very useful unless you're doing something like cinematic or not not very long of a video put your comments down below i think the basically i think the uh four it has features that are not necessary and uh yeah you wouldn't really use them and the battery life is not going to be as good as the three plus so i'm thinking of buying the three plus let me know what you think all right Thanks for watching.